Hi guys, welcome back to another IMF video. And in this video, I'll tell you how I got Artus Lenses Atrox was in office. I obtained the Wind of Restoration and the Ornate Zombie Sword and the Artus Layer, which is unlocked at Revenant 6, Tarantula 6, and Sven 6 at the same time. Enjoy the video, make sure you to subscribe and like the video. So I already have the Sven 6 from getting the Mana Flux. So now yeah, I need the Zombie 6 and the Spider 6 for Auto Slayer to grind the Slayers easily and don't need the bathroom much. So I decided to rev, to rev first because they are a bit easier. And I can solo them pretty easy with the aspect of the dragons. While doing the tier 4 rev, I click in sentence like this. The tier 4 revenants have 1.5 million heals, and I do like about 30k to 40k per hit. So it still takes about 100 hits or maybe 30 hits or more to kill it, so it's kinda tough. But the DPS I can bear because I have the mana flux, I can regen much faster than before. And I just killed another tier 4 easily. Another thing I wanted for long is the ornate zombie sword. You see, the last, 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 last video, I got the healing weapon card, the zombie sword. Well, zombie sword is only the first tier and only has four charges. You need the charges to heal. And the ornate zombie sword and the future upgrade florid zombie sword both have five charges, which is much better, and they heal much better too. And to craft the only zombie sword, you need the zombie sword, an enchanted golden block, and the golden powder. If you don't know what's golden powder, it's a rare drop from the golden ghouls. As you see, the ghouls spawn with the gold armor and has a gold name. They only have 1 in 10,000 chance to drop this, which is pretty rare. But my big man Aatrox gives us 20% more chance to find rare items, which is directly added to your magic farm. So that's pretty awesome. So as I'm grinding the revenants, I'm also hoping to get the golden powder from the golden ghouls. And with like a thousand or less more golden ghouls, I finally dropped the golden powder. Let's go. Nice. Easy. Easy golden powder. Okay. Okay. Nice. Got it. 1 in 10,000, but still easy. Yeah. Okay, so now it's time to craft the only zombie sword. And as you know, I like my gold in Japan. So I have a lot of gold blocks saved actually. So I can craft the ornate zombie sword right now immediately. And in the next episode, which is already recorded, I'm going to use them mostly. And going to use a lot of gold. So go to blocking in the middle, go to powder on the top. No no no, go to powder in the middle. Yiga heal boy. Yeah, the name of it is actually or a zombie sword. As you see, there are five Z's in my stats bar. So, yeah, it's five charges. And it's turned into a gold sword. It's more fabulous. Nice. I like the color. Let's rename it to purple version of Giga Hill. Okay, done. So, with this even better healing setup, I did more Revenant tier forces. Not too fast, not too slow, and draining my plus. Even though Aatrox gives you like about a 50% discount on Slayer Quest, it still costs 25k per tier 4 Slayer, except Blaze, of course. It's still burning my purse up the hill. I had a mill and now I only have 300k. So, if you want to do Slayers, make sure to, you have money. So. It's quite odd.
like 40 or 39 tier 4 revenants, I hit Zombie Slayer 6, which means now I can craft the Wand of Restoration with the materials I already have. So it's 16 revenant by Seraph, which need a lot of string and a lot of revenant flesh. Got from the tier 4 revenants. The strings I have tarantula minions to produce, so I don't need to worry about them. Claim the reward, and then I can craft it into the Wand of Restoration. It has a very big improvement. It heals 120 heals per second for seven seconds, while the Wand of Mending is only 70. That's pretty nice. Park. Let's get into grinding spiders. <laughs> So the next layer is Tarantula, and I also need to burn a lot more coins, so I sold more gold blocks. As you see in my plus, I have 1.3 mil right now. The spider tears force are uh, two spiders, actually. One on the top, one on the bottom. And if you notice the Juju ability, it says do AoE damage to hit three mobs on impact. Which means that if I hit the boss, it actually does double damage. Also, they hit hard and do like anti-healing to you, so I decided also to get a spider talisman to reduce the damage I get from spiders. But it is pretty hard, and you need to kill the blood mother, which is a mob spawned at the top of nest every an hour since the last blood mother died, and it drops a pretty good thing called a luxurious spool, which is uh, like a million. So some people decided to AFK on the top, either loot here or kill, like this frozen blaze guy next to me with a raider's axe, to AFK the broad mother and get the luxury spools and sell to the bazaar. But since the add other updates happened like three days after this recording finished, they made Arashni drop luxury spool too. But I still needed the broad mother because it is the only mob that drops the spider talisman. And finally, after like an hour of waiting because the first one was stolen by a young dragon nun, I have been lucky and got the blood mother. Oh my god, this waiting is long. When will the blood mother spawn, bro? Hey, 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 hey. It's going to spawn here, right? Wait, wait, wait. It's there, it's there, it's there. Yes. Ooh, two spider talismans. I think it's from the loot team. Yeah. Okay, that was Pog. Finally got the talisman. So then, after three days when the Luxor Spool actually dropped from a Rajni, I also started grinding the Rajnis with others, since I have a lot of a Rajni Keeper Fragment from hitting the Spider Slayer 6, and I'm getting a lot of Luxor Spools. Anime X, what's the use for them? They have no use, but it's just sell. Their price significantly fell to like uh, below 100k, while they were like a mil or a mil half. So, but it's still useful for me because if you have nine of them, you can craft the luxurious spool only um, the silky power. The silky power gives you five extra attack speed at all magic powers. And also gives you a ton of a ton of the crit damage. Yeah, it doesn't give strength, but it gives crit damage. Since it's a uh, stone power, so it must be better than the other powers I have right now. I only have sighted and other things. Oh no, I don't have sighted. I have the adept from the end stone mining. So I did more and more, and then I lock unlocked the. Power at last. So after doing a few Rajnis, I got off nice silky power stones enough, and I still have some extra Rajni Keeper fragments. Maybe I'll use them later if I need Tarantula Legendary Pet. Now it's time to unlock the power. Nine total Luxor Spool. You may ask, why do I have to grind all these? The crit damage isn't only for damage, it's also for the campfire thing when you wear the Mastiff armor, you get extra heals per crit damage. 
It's also pretty nice for that one. And let's hurry over to the Thaumaturgist. Also, a little tip for you guys. The Arachne do drop the Luxor Spool, but the, there are two tiers of Arachne. One is from the Four Keeper Fragments, and one is from the Arachne Crystal, which is 20 million heals and a million heals one. Only the a million heals one can spawn, uh, can drop the Luxor Spool, and the other cannot. So, if you want to get Luxor Spool profits, don't do the bigger one, don't do the hard one. It's only for the Dark Queen Soul Drop. And after uh, like two hours or more grinding of tier 4 tarantulas, finally get to my last boss. Last one, here we go. The Juju Strat actually works pretty well. We sh actually shred it. Even the aspect of dragons doesn't do this much. You do this double damage. I maybe maybe they will fix this bug, I don't know. Or just change the tarantula but brought further from a double deck one to a one mob. So last mob? last boss, right? Yeah, last one. Oh my god. This is actually the last one. Three, two, one. Boom! Spider Slayer six. Okay, now I should be able to do the artist layer thing. I don't have to right click back from every boss anymore. This is Park. I'll grind the level 7s later, not now. So, see you next vid. Make sure to subscribe. Next video, we are going to mining.